Okay, so the first thing I start with is my eyelash curler, and you gotta make sure you curl your lashes um, really well for this because it makes a huge difference. I never used to curl my lashes, but it's in the past like year I started, and it's like, oh my goodness, why didn't I do this before? Okay, so the mascaras that I use is the Sexy Curves by Rimmel. You see me use this all the time. And the brush looks like this. And I also use Customized by Revlon. And it has two options. You have length and definition. And then there's also length and drama. So you just like twist this to whichever one you want. So I found these two to be really good together. Like they're probably not the perfect two mascaras to stick together. Um, to get like really good lashes, but for me they work, so um, I'll just show you how to use these two or how I do it with these two. Okay, so we're first going to start off with the Revlon Customize, and I set it to number two, which is length and definition. Now we're just going to coat this on our eyes, just like a couple really good coats. I like to wiggle it back and forth. I also like curl it like up when I'm doing it. Also make sure you get your top lashes. You gotta coat both sides. Okay, so there's one coat. And we're going to let this dry for like just a couple seconds. Maybe about 30 seconds. You don't want to dry it to the point that's like clumpy and like stiff. Because then when you add the next mascara it just doesn't work out. So we're just going to sit around let it dry. Okay, so now we're going to go in with our Sexy Curves and do one or two really good coats of this one as well. Okay, so there it is with the sex curves. I got it kind of everywhere, but <laughs> you just wait till it dries and you just rub it off with a Q-tip. So as we're waiting for that second coat to kind of dry up a bit for like 30 seconds, um, we're going to go and do the bottom lashes. I'm just going to use the same brush. Okay, there you have the bottom lashes. Okay, so let this dry and we'll go back in with our customize on to number one. Okay, so the second coat has gotten a chance to dry, so we're going to go back in with the first mascara we used, which was the customize, and we're going to switch to number one, which is length and drama, and you probably can't even see that. So we're going to do a really nice, good coating with this mascara. And also with this one, we're going to do the bottom lashes um, for a second coat. Okay, so there you have it. So once again, we're going to let this dry. I'm just going to finish up doing the rest of my face, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've given the lashes some time to um, dry and I just finished up the rest of my face. We're going to go back in with the eyelash curler and we're just going to give them one last really good curl.
Okay, and there you have it. So that's how I do my lashes. Um, I only do it really on a, I guess not really a special occasion, but if I'm like going out somewhere or um, things like that, I won't really do it on a regular basis just because it does kind of take a while. Um, but I think it makes my lashes like really big and people always think I'm wearing like false lashes, which I do not wear. But um, I love the two mascaras together, so I definitely recommend the two of them. And thank you so much for watching, and I hope you guys um, tune in for my next video. And I'll see you next time. Bye!